Um, here's a, a daytime medium wave um, test on the uh, 398. Uh, as you can see, that's uh, 1368 uh, kilohertz, uh, 2GN Goulburn, which is around about two or around about 200 kilometres from my QTH. So um, fairly hard um, signal to get from here because it's actually off the back of a directed antenna. So uh, we're sort of um, down in the mud. But it's a good comparison um, on a fairly uh, on a very weak signal. So here's 1368 uh, to GN with the uh, DX398. Now we'll move to the um, the original 909. Getting around all these antennas here. So you can tell there was a trace on the 398. Uh, virtually nothing on the 909, original 909. Uh, we'll now move to the 909X. A trace on the 909X and we'll move to the latter 909 it's doing slightly better uh, than the um, original 909 now yeah, we'll just go quickly go back to the 398 You know, there's not much in it at all. It's, you virtually just say there's a trace on the signal. Uh, I won't use the Eaton E1. Um, they don't have um, ferrite rods. They use the uh, telescopic antenna. And um, this is a fairly noisy environment. So uh, we, we'll end up just picking up more noise. All right. So there's an initial um, medium wave um, test for the uh, 398, let's set it up again. And I would say that the uh, uh, the uh, DX398 uh, is the slightly better on medium wave and followed by the 909X. So I hope you've enjoyed this one.